All right, Rob Allen and Michael Bonner coming to you live from San Antonio. We're out at the KMC conference, and uh, this is the day one update. Michael, I've had a pretty good time so far. How about you? Yeah, it's been a really cool event so far. Um, really nice setup right here in San Antonio, right on the river. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I like it. The, uh, the thing to me is I didn't quite know what to expect. This is our first time coming. We're looking at doing a lot more business with KMC with their uh, automation and, and that type of stuff and their line of DDC controllers. And, um, you know, KMC is a, is a small family-owned company, um, small on the scale of, you know, comparable to the other big companies in our industry. Still a fairly large company, um, but you get that family-owned, small-time feel, but then they really do it, you know, big. You know, they do a lot of good stuff. Um, they brought in some really big big players in, in different keynotes. So um, today started out with uh, Richard Newberry, who's the uh, consultant to the board of directors and former CEO of KMC. Mm -hmm. um, and he kind of kicked us off and uh, and had a lot of good stuff and, and, and talked about kind of what we were going to expect and all that kind of thing. And, and that guy seems to have a whole lot of passion, a whole lot of stuff that he, you know, he really wants to get rolled out. And, and the breakout sessions we'll go into in a minute, but he came into one of them and, and started talking about one of the one of the C's, their five C's, and um, got you know pretty pretty you know good going about it, and so um, really liked that guy a whole lot. And and then um, then Rick Dwyer from Intel was here, and um, he uh, he did our keynote for for this morning, and did a super good job. Um, something that, that he said that you know kind of stuck with me, and I know you're going to go into more detail in just a minute, but um, he said that you know one of the words that he he hates the most in the dictionary is patience, and he said it's not patience that you need, it's stamina to be. Uh, Stamina to be able to push and be pushed, and I thought that was kind of neat and a, and a pretty cool perspective. Uh, what were your takeaways from him? Well, that's pretty cool. I mean, KMC has kind of partnered up with Intel and Dell um, for their new Internet Gateway thing, and I think that's really going to have a huge advantage because the IT world, which um, has always kind of been a struggle with our world, um, making the, the two get along and play nice together, um, and Intel and Dell are huge players in that IT world, so I think it's going to really help smooth the way from operations to in IT. Yeah, really cool, uh, really neat stuff. You know, to to have someone from Intel at your conference is, is a pretty big deal. And I understand tomorrow um, somebody from from Dell is going to come out and talk about um, the Internet of Things and how uh, you can do um, uh, bring your IT to your OT, operational technology, that type of stuff. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, so after we finished up with the uh, um, the keynote, uh, we went into the breakout sessions. Um, I had uh, the opportunity to go to the sales track. And I think you did the technical track, and um, I did strategic selling. Um, you know, some pretty good takeaways from that. Um, you know, the uh, the gentleman that, that led that class for us um, talked about being there for your customer and that type of stuff. And so there were some pretty good takeaways. Um, and then we went into um, several breakouts that were breaking down the five C's. So um, I can tell you the five C's put me on the spot here. So we have um, Converge, Connect, Connect Light, Conquest, Commander. Yep. Did I win a prize for that? Nope. Nope. <laughs> so um, Converge is pretty neat. That's the uh, that's the Tritium piece to it. And then Connect and Connect Light. Um, what what are those? So that's the new uh, programming software for their field controllers, the Conquest line. Um, Connect Light is very cool because they're uh, using NFC technology. Um, so you can have your controller still in the box, the whole pile of VAV controllers still in the box. And with your Android phone or iPhone with the dongle, whatever, um, put your phone on the box, use the NFC chip in the phone and the NFC board in the controller, and you can address your controller, set your baud rate, um, even put one of the pre-can configurations in the controller so that when you power it up, it's ready to go. And then uh, once you get it on the wall, you can actually do the same type thing using the NFC and uh, download a graphic or something like that to your phone. And um, you can even copy programs from one to the next to the next to the next. Correct. Yeah. So, yeah, pretty cool. And then um, what was the uh, commander? Want to touch on that real quick? Or? Yeah, it's still, it's still in the early stages. I haven't released it. I think I've um, – but, you know, it's, it's pretty cool. It's, the, it's the, the, the harbor they're coming up with in their partnership with Dell. Um, as a you know internet gateway an edge device to take all your smart sensors and devices um, and have a way them to push them up to the cloud and you'll have you know commander bx which is their hardware that'll sit locally and then they're also rolling out commander cloud which will be their cloud-based uh, supervisor ser server software stuff and uh, we're not going to talk about price points on the uh, on the camera um, because they are throwing some at us but um 
pretty affordable stuff for, for what they're doing um, based on what they're hoping, what the price point they're going for. They haven't locked it in yet. Um, so it could be something that's, um, you know, a big deal for us and a big deal for our customers. Um, I think our work's kind of cut out for us. Um, you know, it's kind of neat. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm fairly new to the industry, about five years in. You're 15, maybe more years in. Um, and uh, so, but for me, it's been kind of neat because I kind of came into it when it was, this disruption was happening and this IOT thing started taking off and all this kind of thing. And so it's, you know, I came in and, and started learning it one way and then all of a sudden we're, you know, developing and adapting and all this new stuff. And so when I say our work's cut out for us, for me, I, I see so many people trying to attack um, IOT and, and big data in so many different ways. And there's so many different baskets that, that we could start to fill up. And I think we've got to narrow down our baskets a little bit um, and from the distributor level and make a clear message out to our customers. And so do you agree or disagree with that? Sure. I mean, but you still, you know, it's nice having all the tool sets to find what, give, be able to give the customer exactly what they want. Absolutely, and I think that we can definitely do that, and, and that's what we strive for as you know a distributor, is to make sure that you know we have access to everything. That's why we come to these conferences to to vet you know everything out, and make sure that it makes sense for us, and then uh, in turn makes sense for you guys. So, anything that you want to add? Um, what are we looking forward to tomorrow? Do you have you looked at the schedule or anything? Uh, yeah, they're going to go into uh, some more of the technical track stuff on deployment and um, talk about the Niagara stuff and what they're putting on top of Niagara to really work with their controllers well. So that should be good. Very cool, and I think I've got um, Commander uh, Part 2, how to sell Commander and that kind of stuff, so um, I'll check that out. Michael's doing the technical track, I'm doing the sales track, and uh, then we we catch up and track each other later at night, right, and do these do these videos that I know that you guys are growing to love. Sure. All right, Rob and Mike signing off, day one, outro from San Antonio, Big Texas. <laughs>